is faster than switching processes. This is undebatable. We know that is true. The reason is because two processes to be context switched to the same CPU, you have to discard any caches, including the TLB, the translation look ahead buffer, which is the responsible of mapping virtual memory to physical memory, because the entire virtual memory is different between processes. Virtual memory address 700 in process one is completely something else than virtual memory 700 in process two. These are completely different. You cannot reuse this. You're going to be pointing either in an empty location, which will cause a crash, or in a uh, in another issue, which is like in another memory, which is also bad, right? So we don't share that. So we flush the TLB cache. When we flush the TLB cache, we take the head to go back to the memory, to, to back to the page table specifically, to read those mappings the new mapping for the new process. You don't have any of this stuff in the, in the threading. If you switch a thread, the all threads of the same process share the virtual memory space, right? They don't share the stack, but they share the memory virtual memory thread. So if you have like a large TLB in, L, in the L2 cache, it's a beautiful way to store that and share it. So if, if another thread came in, the only thing you need to context switch is the program counter, some registers, right? Uh, you can keep the TLB, which is good, so you can share it. Uh, you can keep the PCB pointer, the process control block, which has the process information, but you need to switch the thread control block. So yeah, so the threading, like long story short, thread, switching threading is less expensive than switching processes, right?